Hello guys and girls and welcome back to Wallowology. In today's video I will talk about the laptop I reviewed um, two months ago. I will be discussing the battery life, speed and some other things. At first I will discuss the battery life. During these times I often used the laptop for video calls and sometimes homework. So I have some experience with the battery life in normal day to day conditions. Whilst having video calls I would get around 2 hours and 15 minutes of battery life. This was on 70% brightness and on best performance in Windows settings. Whilst making my homework, I would get around 4-5 to five hours of battery life. This of course was dependent on what I was doing. Working with Word was closer to 5 hours and whilst video editing I got around 2-3 to three hours of battery life. On Monday I had to go to school where I got through the day without charging the laptop, but I didn't have to use a lot of heavy programs. Moving on, I will talk about the speed of the laptop. As the specs of the laptop might suggest, the laptop is quite a beast. I played some light games on it and did some video editing. I tested the video editing up to 4K footage and it was fine on 1080p, but at 4K it did sometimes stir and lag behind. But if you're fine with that, it definitely is better than some other laptops. Of course, it was slower than my desktop PC for rendering. I also used Unity on the laptop, which, which while whilst making my 2D game ran really smoothly. I haven't tested it for 3D, but I imagine it could sometimes struggle a little bit. And last but not least, the mobility. How mobile is it? Well, with the total package, laptop, charger, mouse, mousepad and the laptop protector case, it weighs around 2.1 kilos, which is very light. I was actually taking it everywhere and I never felt like that my back was hurting or that I was being slowed down. The only real downside was that I found uh, is that the fingerprints show pretty well on the chassis, so you have to clean it more often. But one of the plus things is that it doesn't really run very hot. Even when video editing, it doesn't feel hot to the touch. Um, only on your lap it might like get a little hot but it doesn't really hurt you which is the case in some other laptops that will hurt you when you're using it for longer times but with that said I really like this laptop and I think you're if you're looking for a powerful lightweight laptop for doing work slash homework light gaming and some video editing I definitely still think it was a good buy but thank you for sitting through the video and I will see you next time on Wallowology. Thank you for watching. Bye!